It happens to the best of us. I mean, if you try to build yourself in this life, I'm sure it could happen to you too. What am I talking about? Bad credit. And sometimes it's not even your fault. Walk with me. People losing their jobs. They working in company for years. They get laid off. Company shut down. All kind of things. Then the bank step in and taking the things, the houses, cars, everything gone. That is them fault. No, it's not their fault at all. As a matter of fact, it happened to me. This morning, I got literally know my business. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Welcome inside another edition of JD's vlog. What's up? My name is JD, and today this vlog is sponsored by you don't know King's Lounge Barber Spa, the premier barber spa for men. As a matter of fact, I'm right here at King's Lounge. You need to come check them out. Let me start the thing one time. Break through. Break through. Yeah, just what I say, um, rest in peace to my nephew, Martin Spence, dying in a motorcycle accident, and um, I just want everybody to be a little more careful on the road and thing, and JD, don't mind you sell your bike, but we know you're still here with me now, boy. you know, and you're watching the JD's vlog. There is joy, joy after pain There is joy, joy after pain That's when life takes you Through a rocky place No, there is joy, joy after pain Right, so I will start it off today, you understand right now, and by history, this year is a historical landmark situation. Big up my brethren, Mad Max, you know Mad Max, he is the motorbike god when it comes to popping wheelie, doing stunts. I think I see this man pop a wheelie from Mayaro, straight to Brooklyn, Jerry, that's serious. You understand, big shouts to Max. And of course, he has his own company, it's called Max Graphics Limited, if you want to get your car tint, your maxi tint, your whatever with Tintin if you want to get graphics, airbrush, anything like that. Let me jog your memory. Remember when we was back in junior sec and we used to be traveling in Maxi, right? This is my first um, recollection of Max. He was like a ghost dread because you're just seeing his work all over in the Maxi. You used to see all kind of thing in the Maxi and you're watching because, you know, artwork like that was very fresh. And then you will notice M-A-X, very small, dot, dot, dot. And you know that is the person who did the artwork. That is Max. You understand? Max Graphics Limited. So um, if, you, if you ever went to school in the East West Corridor, you know, you know, you know, you see some kind of graphics in every single Maxi. Big up Max. Right? So, yeah, as I was telling you, today, Dread. Right, so I said I'm going to let you know my business a little bit. Yo, much love to all my fans of this page, all my followers. Um, all you've been asking, what's going on with in the Maxi? Why you have not been seeing the show? Why you have not been seeing the episode? But there is a reason for that. And there is no shame in my game because man it is what it is things is happen so as you know right in the maxi is a program where i interview celebrities artists um stuff like that but i've not been able to produce a show because the maxi has been down for weeks even months on end i fix a i fix something it down again the maxi make about five thousand six thousand dollars seven thousand dollars i had to go and buy a pad for ten thousand dollars nine thousand dollars and so on and so now i know people just figure maxi man are the whole of money and thing and thing but that is not the case we trying to live just like everybody else so when i purchased my maxi i purchased it through scotia bank um i took out a loan for five years and i am on three and a half years all right that's how long i paid for my maxi i bought one of those 15 seaters 
Nissan brand from the Nissan Maxi. I bought it through Nilan Maxi. Well, by the second year, Maxi started to give real trouble. I changed gearbox, I changed turbo, I changed fuel pump, I changed the AC systems about four times. I changed compressor, I just changing things. And that is not even by the third year. I'm already in the third year now and I'm still changing. Only don't believe me. All right, let me go and ask one or two other Maxi men. Break through. Break through. Steven, how are you going? I just good. Let me I come cool. in and talk to you. Break. Yeah, Ole, this is my brethren, Maxi Taxi um, colleague, Steven. Steven, this brand of Maxi is the what? This is the E26. Nissan. Nissan. E26. And purchased from? Um, Massey's. Massey's. Tell yeah. me something. What is your experience with this vehicle mechanically? Is it operating well? Do you get longevity? I mean, what is your experience with it? I have a lot of bad experiences with this Maxi. Okay? Mm. And I, chains, can, right? I can number them for you. The first thing that happened that they introduced this Maxi to us as a 15-seater. Right. And the first thing that happened when they took it, when they went and licensed it, Massey went and li licensed the vehicle, they licensed for 14, it for 14, 14 seats. Feet. So from day one, I started to lose a dollar. Right, right. And in terms of mechanically, you change anything yet so far? A lot of things. Like myself, but what you change? Because I just gave them a whole list of things I change. Okay. Number one, there is a float in the tank right that broke right the bus which was, was causing it was to, st to slow down this was causing not to get the reading of the diesel of the gauge the mm. diesel gauge right that wasn't functioning then there's a thing called the fuel rail i have a lot of bills i can go and bring them and produce it to you all eighteen thousand dollars twelve thousand dollars just to go back by Massey. Right. Right. So they would do the 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 um the repairs of the vehicle. And all the studying is just money, 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 money. When I, next, just now, when I, I purchased mine, this roof was it, spotted like if it hadn't milled you, so we had to change the, the, the roof too. Mm, I yes, had that problem. Yes, and that, that problem also. Um we went to Massey and we formed a little delegation. Uh, with all those who had the E26 and what we did we put on our hazard light and we went up there and we block up the place wow we block up the place that. yes it reached to that where's it change uh, um mechanically mechanically you change gearbox no i change gearbox. i change gearbox i change fuel pump right all right but you see the air condition oh gosh well guys you fixing air condition air condition air, air condition, condition air condition week. air condition and the things is with these maxi let me show the public right these maxis and them is not like the old school one where you have a window on every half yeah. this whole side in the back there block up only one one, one window little window here, here and one, one on little side, back, and, and one on the side here and, and the people know we love the nation we love the traveling public but when they get breeze in the back there yeah, we can't work not even a can't work the the people, the traveling public, they just get on. Yeah, bad. We they love them, on. but it's getting bad. And don't tell the day before yesterday, because yesterday I went by the air conditioner, man, you know. But my maxi don't right now because I went and buy a, I buy a, um, a, a, a the compressor. Forty-five hundred dollars for the the compressor for the air condition. Yes, I well, just I you, buy one right now. I go buy Alistair. You and get I'll away. Buy David. You get away with murder. It's seven thousand five. I pay for mine. Seven thousand five. I recoil in every other week. And Massey took four months to bring that. So this bus was done Down for, for four, four months. months. Hey, watch me. Hey, let me bring it to me. I'll, let me let me find it. You see that four months thing? Make note of that four months thing, Scotia Bank. All you feel I was lying. Make note of that four months thing, I will come back with the four months thing. Anyway, Steven, you have anything else to change? Um I know you have plenty, but at the top of here yes, because it's that, plenty. That, that, plenty things. This is an incomplete vehicle. Right. One. They sold a they sold this, a vehicle that was not prepared already for the maxi work. 
are you this brand in front of here, this other Maxi? That's the Toyota. That's the Toyota. Are yeah. you hearing these fellas getting any complaint no, about? No, 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 no. They have right? one or two little problems, yeah. But not, but not the, the um the, the the like the maximum problems that we have. I you want me to tell you something? Right now, this bus costs me a hundred and six thousand dollars. In maintenance. In maintenance right now and it's in five years of it. I'm telling you, a hundred and six thousand dollars. I want to say something here, but I don't think I should say it on air. Yeah, well, we wouldn't say it on the air, I though. Wouldn't, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say it on air. I was going to say something, but let me go and talk to at least two other Maxi men because they go just figure it's me and you. And I'm sure it's, it's everybody who have this Maxi. So, Stephen, thank yeah. you very much, my brother. It's a pleasure. You know, be safe on the road. You know, they have a lot, a lot of robbery, so we... I'll be keeping you in prayer. Nation, pray for the Maxi drivers, you know what I mean? Because it's hard out there, yeah? Okay, thank you very much. Bless you. All right, on okay. the road. Yeah, let me go, let me go. Let me feel this joke I joke. Come on, tell me. I'm not joking. Come on, tell me. As a matter of fact, I'm not even going to talk to the next deal on Maxi, man. Let me talk to a Toyota, man. Right? There's a Toyota brand here. See it here? Toyota. Big up Transporter, my brethren. Transporter. Easy, Kevin. Oh, yeah, well, this is my brother Kevin. I surely know him if I was traveling on the bus route. Is he transported? This man here, this vehicle is in epic condition here, all kind of graphics and things. Kevin, what vehicle you have here? This is the? This is Toyota Hiace. Right, so I'm doing a little, um, my experience with owning a Nissan brand Maxi. Trying to get a little one or two testimonies and... But you don't have... What have you heard about the Nissan brand? Well, them Nissan E twenty six. But from day one, people complaining about them Maxi and them. From day one. From day one, brand new people have problem, fuel problem with them Maxi. As far as I understand, that they, that they put a filter, additional filter, to trap the water coming from the fuel because it is just so and lose power. No, no, Ole, let me just stop and tell Ole something, right? Eh? I just walking around the place. I not brief. Did I brief you or tell you what to say? No. This is an on the spot interview. Lose power. So continue now. Daddy. So the Maxi, as far as I understand, has lost power. Right. It is car car move at no speed. It has be crawling like a snail. I had that problem. And I had, had that going, problem. You try to go to Nina Masi and they put in an extra fuel pump on the needy bus where they make it go and bleed it ever so often. When you take diesel, bleed out if it have excessive water in it. Right. Well, so, well, say here. Let me just run through what you probably heard. If it's that is all diesel. Well, I, I, I see for myself because I, I, I was driving that, working that far a man before. I buy my own vehicle and that is what I had also do. I also go underneath the bus and prime up a pump underneath that needs that need a mass. You put additional to and trap the water and there's new max and i knew maxi yeah. anyway they're ahead. bones ahead by na 26 i really buy a toyota instead yeah yeah yeah, yeah. but well i mean people, it's... Real, if you see where's gone if everybody did come in the beginning as owners who buy that when there's game problem and pack up the vehicle in Nilan Massey, i believe Nilan massey well i recall all the maxis and well the problem. i think the thing is too that the time when we start because I started experience problems from the second year. So you're probably thinking you're hoping. I was hoping, you know, you change one part, you don't have to change that again. Like I don't change gearbox. Yeah. I don't change compressor for AC. But twice. I recoil in my, my AC all the time. That fuel pump thing, that change. Um man a whole heap of things too. I change um man everything. Everything I don't change. I change I like I change in my pants every day, I change in parts with that thing, you know? And I'm, I'm going somewhere with this. And the thing about it is, you can't even say you're going to put the Maxi for sale because people knowing the Maxi getting in trouble, so they ain't going to buy that Maxi. So you are to stand your loss now and look to invest and buy your next Maxi. Take our next loan and take out your rights and pay it on a Toyota. That is what you want to do, sacrifice and do that because you're going to be spending top in mud. Hmm. Yeah, but you're, you're talking like I have a certain money to just do that, dog. You see, men like you could do that. You see, transporter. <laughs> yeah, that's that. <laughs> yeah, but I ain't laughing at her. It's serious. So, I mean, Ole, let me tell Ole where I'm going with this, right? right? I could go and talk to 
21 drivers and I'm gonna get you're gonna get the same story so my fans have been asking why the, 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 the um, my show in the maxi was down is because the maxi always down if it work two days problem with the AC it down for two weeks if it need a part I've changed the turbo too. And then bus and them, if the AC ain't working inside Nobody is traveling with it. Because it's time to turn out windows. Right, there's you no understand? windows. So, we so love the AC, public. AC must be working either in a Toyota or a E26. AC must be working, alright? Right. People traveling inside us will feel real hot, especially for in Fallen. Right, now I am not always the driver. I don't drive, I have a driver for my Maxi. I drive when I need to. And when I do my show or on the weekends to make a little extra money, I tell you all in my business, right? So when the maxi down, when you and it take long to wait for a part, yeah. they're taking two months to bring in part and thing. Yeah. I'm all to see my focus. Two months to bring in part and all kind of thing, and then you might not have the money because the maxi work a little, a little one week, two weeks, and then you had to take that money now to try to pay installment and do all the other business and whatever. So what could happen is Kevin. What most likely gonna happen is you start to miss. Payments. He said it. You start to miss your payments, and you might pay one month, and then you miss the next month, and then you might be able to catch up with that month. And if that happen, you miss four months. What you think might start happen is? Well, bank coming back for the bus. The bank coming back for your vehicle. So nation, that what happened to me, you know? Man, I phone hook up to the whole system of the max, you know? Oh, you fancy so right? <laughs> anyway, so that what happened to me. I miss one month, I miss two months, I pay a month, I miss a skip a month. And then before I know it, I had a conversation, the bank called me. Well, not the bank because it's out of Scotia, hands, and then the, the claims. Debt collectors. The debt, collect, the debt collectors call you and say, well, yeah, what's going on? We come in for your vehicle, we come in for your business. You know? I know people this thing, people might say, oh, you're a big artist, you're traveling all over the world, you're making money. No. First of all, I sing in gospel. Lazarus, come forth. I sing for love offerings. They say they come and feed the maxi. Now, hear what they say. At this stage, Kevin, right? At this stage, they're not going, they don't want no more negoti negotiation about paying installment. They're taking That'll it back. With all the money. You have to come. What you say? That'll come up with all the money you're taking yeah, back. Money, you take it back. You have to pay all the money. You have to pay all the money. So guess what your boy pay, had to do? Pay, pay, um, you have to pay the fees too. Yeah, but the thank God they didn't reach it out where they, where they actually put their hands on it. They say you have to find the total amount, which was a hundred and I let you know my business, hundred and fourteen thousand dollars. Find a hundred and fourteen thousand dollars. Big shout to everybody who are cool. I love all you. Yeah? You understand? And I know things hard, right? And um it's a long stretch but this is how god is working mysterious ways because i say all of this to say in life don't feel bad because people losing jobs people losing things you understand don't use that as don't let the enemy step in your mind or your spirit to say you know what i can't take it no more in this life i go and kill myself or you know rob some bank or whatever and whatever so with one income it's very hard out here that's why i try to do a little business you know, my video production, all you feel is just games, it's, it's for business. It's business, you know? So, I had to find $114,000. I want to say, I'm not going to call you person name, right? Because, you know, they really stand in the gap for me. And now, the bank ain't take back my maxi no more. But I still have a loan to pay because I have to, yeah, pay, back I have to pay back that person. I want to shout out my moms and my mom friend. I won't call your name because people out here crazy. Next thing they figure you have a whole heap of money and they're coming for you. Nah, nah, nah. So, but you know, God is work. God is work. And all I want to hear something too now. Bam, done. The same week the bank say, we're coming for your thing, I get a job. Right? I go tell you where I'm working because I only come by my job. No, I'm not working at King's Lounge. King's Lounge is only sponsor your boy vlog page. Right? The same week I got a job that is now going to help me pay off for my business. JD, wait, tell me all of business, your business for, we don't want to know. That's all right. Somebody might want to be encouraged to know that, look, you know, don't give up. Things could happen. God is working in your corner. And even though if it look grim, you dig, 
just continue to fight and make our way. You had to get up and try to make our way, you know. So that is my story of why Indy Maxi was off the road. It's because Maxi down and it get it was on the verge. It get repossessed. I get back my things. I love Wendy's. Big shouts to Wendy's. The Wendy's contract was kind of broken because we was doing it on a kind of timing. But I love Wendy's. All you go and eat all, all your belly full of Wendy's. I don't know if they might jump back on with me, but that's all right because the Maxi always shut down. <laughs> you understand? But eat up all Wendy's burgers. I love Wendy's bag. Thank you for watching JD's vlog. This was just an inspirational video to let all you know it's not you alone. Everybody out here feeling it. Things happening to everybody right but don't give up god is good keep strong tag somebody who own a nissan maxi tag them all here if there's a lawyer and you're watching this take up the case let me know how much people we need to get right let me know how much people we need to get to rally up to see if we could get back something from from Massey for buying this faulty vehicle if there's a lawyer and you're watching this link me please let me know what we had to do if we had a petition or whatever and see if we could get back something like loss of earnings, you think we might do that? Uh, yeah, please do. All the Maxis had to come together, but and, 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 and that's true. Yeah, all, everybody had to come and unite and come together. Yeah, but yeah. you know, you know uniting people is good, but yeah. I get frightened, you know. What are you doing back there, boy, dog? Right? I told you so. Thank you for watching another episode of JD's Blog. Remember to like my page, share the link, tag somebody. And um, yeah, thanks for the continuous support. If you want uh, your video to be advertised, and uh, I do my promotion, you know that it's going to be promoted on this page. Big shots to King's Lounge again, right? King's Lounge Rabbit Spa. Yeah. See you later. And I'm still singing. Bronx are coming all the way. Don't worry about it. I ain't singing as much because, you know, the gigs and them kind of Luna Boy Jarnus and, and Blessed Messenger and, and Mark Isaac and them taking up all the things. <laughs> Misa, all of them eating up all the things in Jesus' name, but don't worry, God is good. So yeah, let's tell you.